Hello folks, and welcome to Minerals, Rocks, and Fossil Talks. It's the first day of March, and you know what that means. March Madness is beginning, and this year, the theme of March Madness are animals that are commonly mistaken for dinosaurs. So let's take a look at our first two competitors. We have Dimetrodon versus Nothosaurus. So let's just take a look at why neither of these are dinosaurs. Nothosaurus is a reptile in the superorder Sauropterygia, which means lizard flippers. Dinosaurs, on the other hand, are in a family, well, not a family, but they're in a group called archosaurs. So, totally different group of reptiles. If we look at a Nothosaurus skeleton, they're built quite a bit differently than dinosaurs as well. Especially if we look at their legs, they have a sprawling stance. Dinosaurs have an upright stance. And then their skulls are very, very different as well. Last thing is that Nothosaurus here is a marine animal. Dinosaurs do not live in the ocean. They're terrestrial. Yes, even Spinosaurus is technically terrestrial with aquatic tendencies. So dinosaurs don't have an entirely aquatic lifestyle. And then for Dimetrodon. So Dimetrodon is something called a synapsid. They have a single temporal fenestra in their skull, so this little hole right behind the eye, their single temporal fen fenestra. Dinosaurs, on the other hand, are diapsids, and they have two temporal fenestra, so one behind the eye on the side of the head, and one behind the eye on the top of the head. So different different builds of their skulls. We are synapsids as well, so Dimetrodon is actually more closely related to us than it is to dinosaurs. Dimetrodon also has the sprawling gait, which our dinosaurs do not, and if you look at this skeleton, the humerus and the femur are sitting horizontal or parallel to the ground, whereas dinosaurs are vertical. They've got that fem femoral head like we do that uh, sticks out and then drops the femur down. So their stance is very, very different. And the last thing about Dimetrodon, Dimetrodon is actually from the late Permian period of the Paleozoic era. The first dinosaurs didn't appear for another 33 million years in the late Triassic of the Mesozoic era. So they didn't even live at the same time. You're never going to see them together. And now you know why these two aren't dinosaurs. Pick your favorite. This is not about who's bigger or stronger and can kill the other one. This is just literally, which one do you like better? Leave your answers in the comments and we'll see who moves on. Thanks and have a great day, everybody. Fossilize you later.